Welcome back to Celebrity Page. The wait is almost over. The Handmaid's Tale coming back to Hulu for season two. And although we know we can expect Elizabeth Moss to have another unforgettable performance as Offred, we're taking a closer look at what else we can expect from the dark series. Is this what freedom looks like? The Handmaid's Tale leaving fans on a game-changing cliffhanger with more questions than answers. When we return to Gilead on the 25th, a rebellion is building and Alfred is pregnant and on the run from her commander and his wife. If you'd shown that girl one ounce of kindness, she would never have left. We saw in season one Gilead the relationships and how complicated everything was. And season two, we come off of that and it just gets even juicier and, and hotter. And it, it has felt like a bit of an up and down roller coaster ride. The arguably darker season two going beyond the original story from Margaret Atwood's novel. The show expanding on the world outside of season one, taking fans to the wastelands known as the colonies. We come here, we work, we die. Janine is in the colonies in season two after having a few brushes with death. And I think that she's every day very grateful just to be alive. The award-winning series promising a deeper look into some of the main characters' lives leading up to the creation of Gilead. I'm not kidding you when I say this. When I read the scripts, I put the script down, I write to the writer immediately, Bruce Miller, and I say, I don't know how you did this. And we have beautiful writers. I don't know how you did this, but I am out of my mind. And so are we. So stay tuned for the first two episodes of The Handmaid's Tale streaming on Hulu April 25th. Or you will feel the pain of his judgment. For that is his love.